Hi there everybody, I'm glad to see you here again and this Igor Russian man who brings value through my own experiences and my American English name it is George, yes, Russian analogy of Igor. And today we're gonna watch one video by Patrice O'Neill, The Nasty Show Part 2. By the way, what will I do? It is not like a super reactional of funny things video, it is a learning video. Because I'm Russian and I want to learn English to move to America. And I'm on a level of uh, English uh, studying. Yes, I have been studying for uh, two years and uh, we are on our process. And thank you a lot for one person who recommended this video. His name is Jim Ujivar. Ujivar. Thank you a lot for him. He, uh, he wrote, could you please react to Patrice O'Neill, The Nasty Show Part 2? Yes, I can. Let's go this. Uh, thank you a lot for recommendation. And uh, we will watch it together with you. Let's let's create our p positive vibe to see this. You know what it is, ladies, that makes you so emotional? I'll give you one guess. It's, it's it, because cum, right? Cum is emotional. And you don't come on the outside of your body. That's why guys are so free. We get to see our evil. We get to see. I jerk evil out every day. If I. I jerk evil every day. <laughs> jerk like jerk off, yes. <laughs> you know how many fucking murders there aren't because I jerked off? You know how many times I would have killed a motherfucker if I didn't just shoot a murder? Like, oh shit, I was going to kill a motherfucker because of, cause of that. <laughs> but y'all shit is stuffed up in there. You can't really. Get it out. You can. It's, it's scientifically you can get it out. I know. I know how to do it, and most older men know how to do it. Young guys don't. It's a finger popping technique. Um, this is a young guy's finger popping technique. Twenty years, eighteen years. Remember the first time you was finger popping the first time, and you hit the little ball in the back of the pussy. Remember? I thought I hit a liver. Like you hit the. I'm like, oh shit, what is that? I'm gonna hit the liver. What? Uh, he will put them inside. By the way, one cringe story. 2017. I had my first uh, oral uh, sexual contact. I will not speak so loud because uh, my grandma at home right now is at home and uh, I don't want to speak about some of the sexual things uh, inside of my home. And I had my first uh, first uh, things, yes, and uh, it was oral. It means that it was not like a potential connection of of two things like uh, like a Tetris. It it wasn't Tetris of like uh, inside. Yes, and uh, I it was uh, kind of uh, I touched her pussy. Yes, and uh, I licked her. <laughs> and in one moment I did uh, some of the like uh, fin finger poking, and uh, it appeared in a funny way, like. Uh, she should have her periods in uh, two days, like uh, day after tomorrow. It was planned, but uh, it was planned and something went wrong and her periods started to be uh, earlier. And uh, when I was licking her, uh, like, uh, what, how to, uh, a tw 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 twinkle cave, yes, twinkle cave. I appeared with a bit of blood on my uh, on my mouth. Yes, it's kind of cringy. Okay, let's continue. Is that a kidney? Did I just hit your kidney? There's a ball inside your pussy, sweetie. <laughs> now you, I use three fingers to slide it up and um, get it in there, and uh, and then. It's like the apex is right here about, and you just pull towards you. I know this technique. Yes, uh, he's touching ball, G-ball. And you know it's working because she goes, stop, stop, I gotta pee. And you'd be like, you ain't, you ain't gotta fucking pee. <laughs> and even if you do piss, but just don't interrupt me, wait. Fountain. And you just spray everywhere. If you could come like a guy, you wouldn't take his face and go, come here, motherfucker. Come here. <laughs> and shove it down and kick him. <laughs> Call him a bitch. And he wouldn't cry like, yo. He <laughs> 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 came in my face. <laughs> you disrespected me. <laughs> I'll call my friend like, yo, she just came in my face, mother. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Call me a bitch. <laughs> I deserved it, too. 
I like any noise that come out the vagina. Like air, when you hear air, tell me when you hear air. <laughs> yes, I, I know the sounds. Yes, exactly. Air. Don't make your dick feel bigger than it is. Like, but I'm like, <laughs> there's no space for nothing inside the vagina. Air has to get the fuck, like air has to be squeezed out because there's no more room for shit. Well, my dick is invading. It just, that's right, get out, air. <laughs> my dick needs room. So nasty. You doing everything you want to do, sir. You doing everything you want to do sexually to your wife. You living out your dreams. You living out your dreams. You have a fish hooker. Oh, you know a fish hook. Fish hooker is when you fucking your woman from behind and you just reach in the front. <laughs> <laughs> But she has to be really into it though to make it fun. I like, I make fish faces. <laughs> make it fun. <laughs> <laughs> like a fishy hook. Yeah, but donkey punch, sir. Donkey punch. Donkey punch. I know what is it. Yes, I remember how I learned this word. I learned it in tiny chat in 2019. One person uh, said to me, "What is donkey punch?" It is uh, when uh, you are beating uh, from uh, from back, like you're. You can Google it, by the way. I'm not making it up. Donkey punch. But I didn't try it. She's fucking from behind, right? And just before you come, you punch her in the back of the head, so she sh goes into shock. And seizes up, everything seizes up, including the vagina, and just tightens up. And it's supposed to be the best cum ever, it's supposed to be, because it just wraps around your dick from sh like shock pussies, like amazing, it's supposed to be amazing. You have a gorilla mask? Gorilla mask? That's it. You, you come in a face, right? And then take some pubic hair and throw it at her. <laughs> what? You, you take some of your, like, out out things and throw to her like uh, it is a specific specific charge ritual or what you have a Darth Vader -er? Darth Vader you come in both her nostrils and she has to breathe like this <laughs> You come in both nostrils, like it will be inside of it. I understood, by the way. Yes, but uh, Darth Vader will be like this. Look, I'm your father. <laughs> yes. Or. Okay. You have a poltergeist? Poltergeist is good. They, well, you need your friend, though, right? Like, you, you're fucking him from behind, and then you sneak out, and he takes your place, and then you walk outside and wave at her through the window. And then you go, I'm here. Stunk, Jay. How about the angry pirate? You have an angry pirate? That was good. You, you come in, leg, right? And then you kick her in her leg and she's hopping around like, ah! Caramba! Chicken cutlet. Very interesting. Chicken cutlet is you're fucking on at the beach and your dick slips out in the sand, but you just put it back in. What? Very interesting. Chicken color is you're fucking on it at the beach and then your dick slips out in the sand, but you just put it back in. Jesus, it, it means that uh, he uses his dick and uh, he his dick is wet and after that you make it more like with sand and then you put it inside. <laughs> oh, shit. 
You ever spider man <laughs> spider man is you come in your hand and then sling it in a face. <laughs> that lady's disgusted. How about Houdini? You ever Houdini? A good one, Houdini. You, you're fucking her from behind, right? And just before you come, you spit on her back so she think you came, and when she looks back, you really get her in the face. Uh. <laughs> and you go, ta-da! Like, uh, it is our uh, congratulations. All right, I gotta go, man. Y'all take care, man. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Yeah, nice. Nice, and I understood it uh, fully and almost correctly, and it is interesting. Really, I understood nasty things. I think that my vocabulary in nastiness uh, is improved, and uh, I understand that I need to improve my vocabulary in another places. If you know something, like uh, you can recommend it in the comment section below, like... Uh, this stand-up is about maybe politicians will be, like it is Dave Chappelle maybe. Uh, or maybe you can recommend like about George Carlin, watch this and you will learn something about religion. Or maybe watch this kind of Jimmy Carr stand-up and you will learn something about relationship. Or maybe uh, something like uh, dirty things of uh, <laughs> like Bill Burr, Bill Burr of Psychopath Life. You will learn psychopath vocabulary. You can join to this, you can recommend this this in the comment section below it will be interesting to know and have a wonderful life have a wonderful day and uh, it is nice uh, like uh, ending of my day to watch this video and upload it to you because it is uh, 8 30 p.m of moscow time and uh, i will go right now to sleep because i wake up early at 4 30 a.m yes i do this for almost uh, almost two weeks yes and uh, i want to continue it uh, because i do productive things i upload videos also on my russian channel you can join it uh, in the end screen you will find like my russian channel and uh, there i upload content for voice over actor air artists and it's interesting thank you a lot again improve so daily and be cool and improve sell yes i said it again okay improve so daily improve so daily bye bye <laughs>